Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to Hollow Knight. We just got up from the seat on the 6th train, so we are going to figure out which way we need to go. I assume how this works is one of these paths takes you to some area. <laughs> okay, I just realized as I was saying it that what I just said makes absolutely no goddamn sense. I was going to say one path takes you one way, the other path takes you the other way. But really that's kind of... Okay, we're in the abandoned station, aren't we? Yeah, I think so. We re that's really the... Oh, maybe not. That's really the crux of the situation, isn't it? One path takes you one way, the other path takes you the other way. This is not... Holy shit. Okay. I thought I was going back to a previously explored area, but it looked like that ain't the case. Okay, this is a dead end. Let's check out the other way. I would really, really love if they disconnected to the train station at the starting area because I really, really would like to go back with this 2100 souls. I know I keep calling them souls, geo, whatever. Uh, Minecraft diamonds. Okay. It looks like there is... Okay. There's a limited amount of paths. Nice. I think this is where I want to be. It's closer in general to where I need to be. What the hell is that symbol? Is that an NPC? Oh, I totally get how this works. I totally get where we are. Shit, that's still a long way away. I gotta get to the failed tramway. Whatever. Okay, what can I do? What can I do but go up? So what I'm going to try doing today is making it back to where I need to be. And where I need to be is... Oops. Not getting hit. Not getting double hit by the enemies. Where I need to be... Shit. I want to get killed. Cool. Where I need to be is uh, the crystal cave. I know it's not called that. It might actually be called that. The mine area. Shit, this is not where we need to go. My navigational skills leave something to be desired, obviously. I am really about to die to these things. Fuck. We are not off to a good start. I mean, it wouldn't put me too far back. The... Uh, the tram has a checkpoint in it, so it don't matter. Let's take a bath, fill up our spirit, and let's get a move on. So, yeah, Hollow Knight. Hopefully we're actually going to be making some progress here <clears throat> today. From the looks of it. This is going to be a I take a shit ton of damage type episode. That's how it's starting off. Sometimes we have that type of episode. I try to get myself sorted. Oh shit, I didn't see you. I'll try to get myself sorted. Ah oh, no, it doesn't work. It's gonna be one of those episodes. Well, it doesn't matter. I mean, when you think about it, how much damage you take doesn't matter at all. What matters is actually making progress. I know this is where the spiders are. You know, where the enemies uh, turn into those weird spider type creatures. It's all good, though. 
by the way, without, you know, doing over like too much self promotion. Uh, yesterday, I started a new stream where I'm starting to speed run Dark Souls 2. I'm just talking about it because it's fresh on my mind. It is absolutely crazy. Uh, I've never tried, like proper tried speed running a game, like learning how to do it. Uh, I'm trying to learn now. Honestly, I feel like that first attempt or those couple of first attempts were not the worst. They were obviously not the best. I managed to checkmate myself several times. But it's par for the course. I have no fucking clue where you need to go. Hmm. Other side, maybe? All I want to do is get to the stag station or the tram station. They both lead back to where I need to go. Yeah, I just wanted to say, if you are interested, the VOD of it is up on my channel. God, I feel so... I don't know why I feel like this. Every time I self-promote, I'm like, damn. I'm becoming a stereotypical asshole YouTuber. I'm really not. Or at least... It ain't the intention. But... I still feel that way for some reason. Yeah, I'm gonna... Take the easy way out, as in skip enemies, because I am really not in the mood to fight these guys. Although, to be fair, these guys have gotten way, way easier with a better weapon. I take, I say as I immediately take metric fuck tons of damage. Wait, hold on. I missed it. That is the stack station sign, isn't it? Now I'm beginning to doubt myself. I swear there was a shortcut back. Uh, maybe there wasn't. If there wasn't, I'm kind of screwed, aren't I? Because then we're going to have to go back up the fungal wastes. Where is, how do you get a legend on the map? Oh, it's a cocoon. The stack station is... Fuck. We are so far away from everything. That's where you need to go. God damn it. Well, this is going to be one of those episodes where I backtrack like hell. People are probably super frustrated at what I just did. People who have played the game, I apologize. I don't have a good memory on all the little emblems, all the little signs. I thought this stack station was activated. It don't matter. I'm gonna shut my phone up too. Give me a second. Shut up, phone. Alright, so as I was saying... What was I saying? Oh yeah, we need to backtrack. Oh, and this is where they do this shit. Which I hate. Where the enemies just like spawn from under you. Didn't quite work out. I was trying to be cool and avoid everything, and I kind of avoided nothing. So as we backtrack... I, we can't go up these walls. That's the problem. But yeah, these enemies, you can definitely tell that my weapon has actually gotten stronger. And that's another thing, I need to w visit the 
the weapons guy because I do have a pale ore and I think that's what you need to upgrade your weapon so yeah that's bueno what's not bueno is I don't remember oh there it is this is weird going down but gotta go down to get back up what was that terrible speaking of that that was some shitty horror movie a couple of years ago actually it wasn't that shitty as above so below that's what it was called I think in the Paris catacombs and it was not that shitty but fuck it's not the first time I've done this it was not that shitty but the ending I specifically remember the ending was stupid that she like went down a hole the main character and she ended up on the Paris streets like flipped around whereas that was you know like a prime example of a horror movie that I think should have ended with the main character dying because that was a kind of like the whole theme of it oh well I don't know why I'm reminiscing about mediocre 2010 horror movies they had some cool visuals yeah I mean there's certainly been worse horror movies since then way way worse ones this this area I remember there was like some NPC here yeah yeah, yeah. oh those are enemies what a strange area. <laughs> That's pretty funny. I remember this NPC. This left a lasting impression on me. Oh yeah. This is what you do. I knew it. Fuck. <laughs> I don't I roll I so don't wanna die. I'm going to die, aren't I? Yep. I knew it. I knew it. Which puts me back all the way yeah, down down here. Wonderful. Man, why is backtracking so difficult in this game? <sighs> Warp points are like really not frequent. That's the biggest issue. I should have rested at the other... whatever, I'm stupid. Well, this is going to be a backtracking episode, boys. I guess, you know what, no. I'm not going to put you through this torture. Uh, I almost don't want to put myself through this torture. I'm going to... Are these things still spawn? I'm going to edit this out actually. That's what I'm gonna do. So see you guys. Okay, I made it back. The issue with dying like this, always, is that is that this type of dying really fucks with your perception of how long you've been going in the episode. So if the episode ends up shorter than normal, or longer than normal, well, I apologize in advance. That was only like three minutes, so it shouldn't matter too much. Cool. Nice. Almost nice. Yeah. Hmm. So fucking far away. Maybe it's easier to get to the Mantis village. Oh no, actually, there's a shortcut. Cool. 
or shorter path. And they really make you go through the motions. Oh, it explodes. Yeah, I forgot. I haven't been here in this area for ages, so I forgot the gimmick here is that enemies explode. But damn, just look at the amount of damage I'm dishing out. The one-shotting enemies. Hmm. Yeah, here we go. So we have a stag station here, finally. That is extremely convenient for me, because I can just go back to Dirtmouth. One thing I'd really like, it would be a really nice zoo, is... Okay, I keep going the wrong way. Uh, those mask fragments that give you one more HP. I am one away from it. From getting one. So that would be like the shit if I could... If I could get one. Uh, hella nice. One more HP. I would take that. This is how he sits on it. I've said this many times. It's awesome. I already have a feeling that this game is going to have a depressive ending. It's just, you know, with the themes of it, you know, it kind of goes along Souls themes. I feel like it's going to... Hella depressing ending. But maybe I am wrong. Do you see that co talk live beyond the... There's mines and machinery and all sorts of valuable rocks for him. I think he always gives you like some hints as to where to go. Because he's talking about the mines. Oh. Oh. This is not good. This is muy not good. <sighs> Fuck it. We are spending, boys. We are spending. Cleared it out. Wonder if she <sighs> says... Yep, that's nice. Hella cleared everyone out. So what do you spend all this Geo on then? I know there's like some other NPCs around uh, which sell shit, but... I don't know. So we got the forgotten, forgotten Crossroads. This temple, yeah, this is gonna be the final area. You can tell. I mean, it has the three little enemies' faces that we're supposed to kill. There was, you know, one of the things I'm bothered by with this area is I seem to remember that I missed one of those worm thingies. Uh, you had to, like, bounce off of shit to get to him. Like spikes. And I remember clearly failing at it. And... I should go back, but I have no earthly idea where it is. Alright. I've been waiting for this for so long. Yep, there's something up there. Crystal Peak. Almost. I was almost right. I missed some. I think it was a rancid egg. Wonderful. New area. New horrors. All that good shit. I mean, all these stalls are gonna be hella cheap for me. Ain't even a problem. I don't know why I like specifically beelined it with this path. Oh, okay. This is nice. We have like a proper entrance. I almost have a feeling it's like somewhere over here. Like this one? 
No, this is the the path. It was definitely like a dead end ish type deal. There's quite a few of those though. Whatever, I should reset it to this checkpoint in case I die in the Crystal Peaks. Which I don't have a map for. Yeah. Don't have the basis of it. It's all good. Not it. Whatever. I'll find it. Walkthroughs exist for a reason. I mean, without... Yeah, I'm afraid... I had a feeling. What the hell do you do? Or are these like environmental hazards, these enemies? These enemies that I just ran into. It looks like they might be. We have the obligatory mine area, of course. Uh, this reminds me of Demon Souls. Like a lot of this game reminds me of Demon Souls. There's gonna be an elevator here. Oh, nice! That's pretty cool. Is that gonna be the theme of this area? The conveyor belts? I'm down with that. Man, these, this game is super cool. Oh, you can kill them. Oh, from the front. I thought it was going to be the exact opposite. You have to get them from the back. We have new music too. I should go and listen to this game's soundtrack. People have been telling me that's awesome. The bits and pieces I've heard did sound awesome. Okay, yeah. The conveyor belt gimmick is going to be the main cause of a lot of deaths. I can already tell. Fuck. Prime example. I said example weird there. Example. You just gotta watch which one is which. Oh shit. I thought that was an NPC. Damn. Kinda the feeling that was those worm things were not gonna be like the only enemies. We have something this way, something worth exploring. I assume we shouldn't touch that. Nice. Oh, <coughs> I got your game as I'm trying not to choke. I get it. It's like more of a platforming area. Oh, actually. Hello down with that, rancid egg. The question is, no, you cannot. My, what I was curious about. Is whether you can bounce off of it. Turn it and then land on it. Oh, sh Whoa, okay. This area kind of crazy. And of course, you better believe that I'm lost. You better believe it. Man, their attack, their attack windows are like hitboxes, I should say, easier to say, are massive. I swear I'm not getting hit by any of these enemies on purpose. Whoa, okay. I like that, I'm down with that.
the type of mechanic I enjoy. Oh, and we're back here. Interesting. So I don't like loops together. Hmm. So I'm guessing this is the way. Well, of course, it might not be. There's a ton of other paths that I could go on. I'm just like barely keeping myself at 3 HP, which is kind of shitty because I really should have more. Oh, worm. Damn, he's locked away. I feel like we gotta go this way. I'm gonna get that worm. Don't worry about it. This enemy is quite a bamboozle. Especially being on a small platform. I fucking missed. Oh, this one just like straight up comes at you. It don't give a fuck. How can I not get above 3 HP? There's something... Is this a bottomless pit? Okay. Shit. This is how it links together. This is not good. Telling you why it's not good is because you better believe we got a backtrack. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Well, if I'm here, I'm gonna see if I've... I think I've managed to level up my, my dream nail or whatever. This thing. If I'm like accidentally here, I might as well, I might as well go. Damn. Well, lesson learned, you know, and I haven't unlocked like anything in the Crystal Peaks, i.e. a tramway or a stag station or whatever. So that kind of, that kind of sucks. There's a nice rhythm to these platforms as I was going up. <laughs> That's it. Oh, I think I might have already talked to her. Well, this puts an interesting spin on things. I.e. Once again, I have hella backtracking to do. So I think what I'm going to do is I'll wrap up this episode here. Again, apologize if it's really short. Uh, and we will get back to the Crystal Peaks, probably to that checkpoint I unlocked. So yeah, I think with that, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this episode of Hollow Knight. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. And I will see all of you next time. Goodbye.